Hey guys, Rendon Ricks here with TJ Free. In this video, I'm going to quickly show you how to mirror your content from YouTube over to Library. So Library is an alternative to YouTube. It's a video streaming platform, uh, but it's one that you download right now and run on your computer as a separate piece of software. So it's not one that you access and get to from the web browser like Chrome or Firefox. Instead, you download and install it like a program on your computer. And what it does, it uses blockchain technology like Bitcoin, Ethereum, cryptocurrency type technology to connect to different computers around the world for video sharing instead of going through a central gatekeeper like YouTube that kind of makes the rules and can... There's just some issues with, with YouTube uh, at the moment. And so for me, I, I'm going to be mirroring over my channel right now. I'll still be producing video here on YouTube, but I'm going to be providing another option for people who maybe don't have access to, to these YouTube videos or who would like to download them and watch them on their computer or watch them offline on their device. Um, YouTube doesn't allow that right now, but this other platform library does. Uh, and so I'm going to show you how to do that right now. Let's hop over to the screencast and we will sync my YouTube channel to library. The address is lbry.com, um, and I'll include the link in the description of this video. I should also say this is not a sponsored uh, tutorial or review or anything. I have no contact with the folks at the library, and um, I'm just doing this for my own interest. This is something that I've been wanting to do for a while. Kind of been keeping an eye on library since their very, very early days, uh, as I've kind of been involved in the cryptocurrency space. And I really agree, you know, my, my belief systems and values really align with what they're trying to do. Um, which is why I'm doing this. So there's an option here to download the client for Linux, uh, which is what I'm on right now. But what I'm going to do is click on Creators, and I'm going to go to the YouTube Partner Program. And so I'm logged into my YouTube channel over here, and uh, I'm going to just go through the steps here. I haven't actually done this yet, so we're going to kind of do this live together. I already did read through. I encourage you to read through the frequently asked questions to make sure that syncing your content and mirroring it over is what you want to do and know what's all involved in that. I'm going to click on Claim Your Channel, and then it just says, um, what's, what's it going to do? Enter my channel name, okay, TJ Free. And then I'll just click this box. I want to sync my content to the LBRY network and agree to these terms. You should read the terms. They're actually not very long at all. There's only like um, four points, um, it, and it's, it's pretty straightforward. So go ahead and uh, I'll click Claim Now, and let's see if it's going to find it. So it, it finds it that I'm already logged into Google. And it says, um, which channel do you want to do? So I click my main channel and it says the app isn't verified. So I'll say advanced and I'm going to say, uh, I'm going to go to it anyway. Go to lbry.com, which is it's saying is unsafe, uh, but I'm going to do it just because it's very early. They're still developing this and it's just not on YouTube's radar. Okay, cool. So confirm your channel, agree to sync, claim your credits. Oh, by the way, they, they're giving me... Um, I guess they are giving me $200 to bring my stuff over. That's not the reason I'm making this video at all. And it's really not even the reason I'm going over to library, but they are giving me $200 worth of credits um, just because I have enough subscribers. So it looks like they've sent me an email. I need to log into my email to confirm that. I'm sure you're familiar with how that works. Let me do that real quick. So here's that email here. I'll just click confirm your account. And it should redirect me and take me back there. I'll tell them I'm not a robot. So I've confirmed my email address. I come back to this page, um, and it looks like, uh, I guess I'll just interact through my email because they're still working on making this a more automatic process. Right now it's manual, which means they're gonna have control of the videos that they mirror over until they give control over to me, and there's a process for doing that. Um, so I'm just gonna probably leave this video here and do a follow-up um, once some of my videos start to be active on library. Okay, it's been a few weeks now since I imported my YouTube channel over to library. And I just wanna give you a quick follow-up on that. So here's the credits I have. They've actually given me 12,500 uh, different credits. If I go to rewards, we can see that. You get rewards for referring friends and for just testing and using the platform. Here's sort of a uh, like a, an accounting of the different rewards I've gotten. This big one, obviously, is this 12,500 just for bringing over my YouTube channel. But they gave me one for verifying my email and different things that you do. Anyway, I, I figured out the, the rewards total that I've gotten at a, at a rate of about one cent per credit. Um, so let's kind of divide that number by 100, but it's basically about $125, a little more like $130 uh, worth of credits. And again, like Bitcoin or any cryptocurrency, this can increase and decrease in value. Uh, if you look, if we look on this here, this is a website 
bitcoinranking.com. But I believe we can look at like the last year. So there's been times when it's been as high as three and five cents. I believe when they first did their like launch, like it was up to a dollar once. So that'd be, well, that'd be crazy. That'd be like $12,000. Anyway, um, I'll do another video on how to download the Libri client if you're interested because you can check out my channel and some of you have requested like how can I download these for offline and so here's all my videos here and you can actually download them and watch them on a phone or a tablet when you don't have internet access. Um, library allows for that and, and I, I completely support that as well. It also has some cool things where you can like tip and share and some different social things um, involving the social currency. I will say the Linux version, I'm not super impressed with it right now. It's very buggy on my Linux Mint, um, just the interface for like, um, but it, it runs much more stable on Windows. Anyway, check out that other video and uh, check out the link if you're interested in downloading this and trying it out for yourself. That link is also a referral that helps support my channel. So thanks for watching. If you have any questions or comments below, go ahead and, uh, I mean, leave your questions and comments below if you have them. And I look forward to catching you in the next video.